Temperatures were a few degrees colder today than they have been in the past few days, but still a little muggy for my standards. <laughs> Will they continue to drop? Let's check in with meteorologist Sean Stiles. He's live at La Costa with a first look at your microclimate forecast. Sean? Uh, Steve Marcella, it definitely is a slow cooling trend, but nonetheless, we are heading in the right direction. Things are slowly but surely cooling off. And by midweek, we will see temperatures back to where they should be today around the county. Here's a look at your highs. Now, it was still very morning. I'll have more details for you on that and tell you why we're here at La Costa. It's the 21st annual Natural High Gala. It's coming up in just a bit. Sean, live at La Costa, where uh, people are starting to gather for a great event being held tonight. Sean? It is a wonderful event, Marcella. This is the Natural High 21st Annual Gala. It's all about inspiring youth to stay off drugs by finding their natural high. And joining me now is D'Artagnan Crockett, bronze medalist in the Paralympics in 2012 London. You're already qualified for Brazil, uh, and you're here tonight, and we've got you on camera. Your natural high is judo, 90 kilograms. Tell us why you're here tonight, and that's obviously a softball question. Um, when I first found out about Natural High, it's something that really, really hit close to home because it's something I grew up with my entire life. I've seen what it does to people. I've been around that environment my entire life, so I know all of the negatives and none of the positives because I've seen it. And it's something that I want to be a part of because it's, it's just something so powerful that you just don't see in an inner city. A lot of times you don't know what a natural high is, although you might be doing it every day. And just seeing kids kind of like make the wrong decisions when at the time they don't know that it's the wrong decision because when you don't know, there's no wrong or right decision, you just made a choice to do it. So it's something that's, that I think is a very powerful organization. I hope it continues to grow for for kids across the U.S. and maybe even other countries if it ever gets international. and. Just something I can definitely see myself being a part of well, as an and, ambassador. And, and obviously, you as an athlete, you carry a great message. You're a bronze medalist. You're going to uh, Rio. So I think you're going to skip right through the silver medal and go right for the gold, right? I think that's exactly the plan. But nothing's guaranteed until I'm on the podium. So I'm excited just to be a part of it. Well, thank you for stopping by with Thank us. you for having me. It's our pleasure. Let's jump into weather. You go out and meet and greet. I know there's a lot of people out there that want to say hi to you. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You. All right. And for you folks in the mountains, also a cool down and a chance of rain. We'll send it back to you in the studio. All right, Sean, thanks. Can you